Hey loves, it's Polita Celine and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I wanted to do a day in my life. Just kind of what our day looks like, especially being a new mom. I'm so excited to finally have my baby boy and I've just been taking it super easy. I'm not being hard on myself. I'm not trying to do things that um, are too much. Like I understand that I have a newborn and he needs all of my attention and all of my love and all the snuggles and so I've been taking it really easy. So now that we're kind of on a schedule, like on a routine, um, I'm like, okay, now I can actually like get the camera out, get myself ready um, and do a little bit more than before. So right now he is down for a nap now he can nap anywhere between 20 minutes to two hours during the day it just depends how tired he is um, what his night was like what his day was like and he had a pretty good night and he had a really good feeding and so I'm pretty sure he's gonna take a longer nap now I do have him inside of his crib inside of his nursery which I'm trying to get him used to nap over there because before he would only nap in our arms and it was so hard for us to like put him down anywhere so literally for the first month and a half we just held him in our arms at the entire time while he napped during the day and then for some reason at night he would nap really well and or he would sleep really well and he sleeps like long stretches uh, throughout the night which is great because I would rather have that I would rather have him sleep in his own bassinet during the night and then in the day we don't mind holding him all day so um, so yeah so we've been able to do really good right now he it looks like he's still sleeping I have my phone here um, with my monitor that's what I'm using <laughs> Um, so I just have that propped up here uh, since we got into a routine I'm able to take care of myself a little bit more so I can get ready throughout the day right now I'm gonna grab some lunch. I don't want to heat. Oh my water I'm like eating here on top of my counter. So I just made myself a sandwich. I don't know why I really want a sandwich I wanted to use a avocado that we had the avocado. So I'm like a sandwich sounds really good mm. And then I have some spicy hummus. So good. Mm. With carrots. That is so good. Mm. My other camera is charging, so I have this one. Let me show you guys my outfit of the day. And this is pretty much what I wear all the time now. I just need to be comfortable, and I need it to be just like super like efficient <laughs> when I wear this. So I want to be comfortable, and so I have these leggings, which I bought when I was pregnant. They're just some leggings that are high-waisted, and they're really stretchy and they're so comfortable and then I have a nursing tank top I have a bunch of these in different colors I'll have everything linked down below for you guys um, but I just need something that I could easily move in and be comfortable in all day because I just need to be comfortable and then I'll usually wear some kind of sweater this one is so cute I just got this one um, just so that it's easy access so I'm not wearing like a full coverage sweater but I could easily take it off throughout the day since it's getting a little bit chilly now um and this is just really comfy okay and when i'm down here i like to wear like chanclas or loafers or something and i just want to feel fab even if i'm just home <laughs> so these are part of my push present um and i'll show you guys what else i got and then a lot of you guys were asking what my push present was and it is this bracelet right here the gold one it is the Cartier Love Bracelet, and this is a small one. Um, I wanted something dainty and small. I asked a bunch of different people who had these bracelets, whether they like the thicker one or the thinner one, and it was just mixed reviews. It's pretty much what makes you feel more comfortable, but I didn't want it to be too, too big, and I wanted something a little bit dainty, so I did get this one, which is really awesome. Ricardo gave that to me as a push present, and then Benji's name is engraved inside. And then I have this bracelet from Tiffany's, a silver one with the beads, and and I never take those off ever. I even shower with them. I sleep with them. They're just so comfortable. And then at the end I have my watch because I need to keep track of when Benji eats, when he sleeps, and it just helps us stay on
on track and my phone is not always by me so this is really nice to have and then I have the sparkle bands watch band which I love so much I have different kinds and I rotate them with my outfit it just makes me feel like super fab when I'm wearing it and I get so many compliments on them and they're so pretty they're super unique I love the studs on them and I'll show you guys which ones I have because I have some more that came in and they are 100% authentic repurposed bags so you are getting a Louis Vuitton piece if you get like something like Louis Vuitton they have Gucci they have um, Dior all different kinds and you can customize these if you want you can reach out to them you can pick whatever rhinestones you want you can pick whatever um, lining you want the one that I have right now is like the leopard or the cheetah print and then it has like the gold rhinestones which is pretty awesome and then you could choose whatever width or size you want and I am partnering up with them in today's video to give you guys a coupon code so many of you guys have asked about the watch bands that I have and I'll show you guys my little collection because they're so beautiful and I switch them out depending on like what I'm wearing what outfit I'm wearing I am partnering with sparkle bands in today's video because I wanted to get a coupon code for you guys since you guys have been asking all about them especially over on my Instagram where I often show you guys like what I'm wearing and I often switch them out because they're just really really beautiful and pretty and I'll show you guys my collection because I have a few of them and then some just came in too. Since they do repurpose authentic like designer bags they also have like different accessories. They have earrings, they have like hats, they have like a pacifier clip which is really cute. Um, they have watch bands. They just have a bunch of different things. On their website they Besides watch bands, they also have like different accessories. Look how cute this is. I got this for Benji and it has like the LV logo here, which I love. And then these just came in. Look how gorgeous these are. Oh my goodness. We have this one. Wonder this if you're one. Sleeping in now. But you and you two in that bed. It's stuck in my head. Did it make you? recently got this jewelry box and it's perfect for all of my watch bands. I like that you could see on top and has that glass case and then on the bottom it also has more space so I don't have too much filled out yet but I love how the top looks and that's my collection. It is so crazy how he woke up just in time. Right now is when he is at the most calm so I can put him in a stroller and we can go for a walk. He's so cute. He's talking. Are you waiting for our walk? You want to go for our walk? I'm trying to take advantage now that it's still nice outside to go on a walk here and there just around our neighborhood. So that's what I'm going to do now. Um, I'm ready for the day so it makes it easier for me to leave the house if I get er if I get ready really early on. And he is on schedule. I want to say like 80% of the time which is so crazy. He'll eat for exactly like 40 to 45 minutes. I change him, he's up for about maybe 30 to 40 minutes, then he starts getting fussy after that and wants to sleep, and then I go ahead and put him to sleep, and then he'll wake up, whether he gets 20 minutes, 30 minutes, or a full hour, or even two hours, he'll wake up to eat exactly three hours later. And he always, 
he's always on time to eat he's never always on time to nap but he will whether he's sleeping or not he will wake up every three hours to, to eat which is so crazy to me that he's on his own schedule I didn't even do that for him like I just kind of started the routine and then he just wants to eat every three hours and it happens on the dot it's so crazy um, so whether he gets a nap long or not um, we're still on schedule and it's fun because at night he sleeps so even if he doesn't get the best naps during the day at night he'll sleep really well so let's go for a walk baby I'm gonna put him in the stroller right now and we're gonna get going ready for a walk let's go for a walk come on let's go this is the perfect time yeah let's go you excited huh let's go when the light hit your face We were just kids But I knew right away That I will be with you Until I stop breathing What are you doing? Uh. Yeah, you just chilling in mama's arms? Are oh, you sleepy now? Yeah, you're sleepy Should we put you to bed? Uh. Okay, so it is the end of the day now. It is around, all right, so it is around, what time is it? All right, it is currently 6.30. Ricardo came home from work, and since the last time that I talked to you guys, I came home from taking a walk, and then I fed Benji, and then we were just like playing around. Um, I changed his diaper a few times and then um, I put him down for a nap and right now he's napping in his crib in his nursery and I am so proud of him. So before Benji would sleep in our arms and that was the only way that he could go down for a nap. He really like, refused to sleep on his own and it was fine when I had all of the help here with Ricardo and his mom and my mom. It was easy because he would take turns um, and then we would try really hard to put him down on his own for a nap so that way he can learn to sleep on his own because I know that's important and he just wouldn't and we felt so bad we didn't want him to not sleep so we would just continue to hold him. It wasn't until I started taking a course, it's called uh, Taking Care of Babies and that's when we were able to understand a little bit more about how his naps um, can go, like how to help him sleep on his own and I've been able to do it and it's been pretty awesome and it's kept us like on a schedule that's not strict it's super lenient but it just helps you understand when the baby needs to sleep um when he needs to eat like what cues to look out for so we've been doing that and it helped out tremendously which he was doing so well at night um but during the day it was just difficult he would sleep in his bassinet during the night which is so crazy but we couldn't get him to sleep during the day now that ricardo's home we're going to eat dinner and then we're going to start the nighttime routine so that is where i'm going to leave off on this video and i hope you guys enjoyed it a little sneak peek into what our day looks like it's just very chill and i'm not being too hard on myself when it comes to like getting things done 100 percent. but it's nice to be able to like get out of the house and just like uh do things here and there and just snuggle little Benji as much as possible because I do I do enjoy that very much and I love like him being a newborn and just being so cute and smiling and talking and you know just I don't know and I just love smelling him like I always hold him really close to me and I smell his little newborn smell and it's so sweet and adorable so yeah I'll have all the information to anything that I talked about in this video down in the description box below including these sparkle bands and I do have a coupon code for you guys um, so if you guys want to check these out make sure to check out the link in the description box below along with my coupon code because you do get a really nice discount and I'll talk to you guys next time which is besos